Volvo's work on electrification technology naturally includes a systematic approach to safety issues related to battery power. The basic perspective is that a battery-powered Volvo must be as safe as any other new Volvo when it comes to owning, driving and servicing as well as in the event of an accident for everyone involved. The position of the 280 kilogram lithium-ion batteries and all power cables requires extremely high demands on a systematic approach with crash worthiness issues. We apply the same high safety standards on all our Volvo products and that is based on a holistic view and real-life traffic safety data. To find the optimal battery location outside the crumpled zones was one of the key issues during the development of the Volvo C30 electric. The crash-tested cars are part of a rigorous test program that also includes a large number of virtual crashes. Components and systems are also tested individually. All these tests showed that the encapsulated batteries should be placed centrally in the car without any contact with the passenger compartment. The heavy batteries and the new electric motor led to the development of a new engine mounting in aluminum and a new fronted structure based on our unique patented structure that we have in all Volvos. To help protect the occupants and the batteries in a side impact, the car's deformation zones have been further developed, since the tunnel itself can no longer be active in a collision. The result is a reinforced tunnel area and floor structure, and an adjusted length of the SIPS tube. The Volvo C30 electric uses the same six crash sensors and system, two in the front, two in the doors, and two in the B pillars, that after 50 milliseconds activates the car's airbags, and also switches off the 400 volt power supply in the event of a frontal, rear end or side impact. Volvo also works together with the emergency rescue services, providing them with detailed instructions on how best to handle various Volvo models in the event of an accident. Safety will never be a compromise for us at Volvo Cars.